Welcome back to 4PL. I'm your host, Destro. I'm with my boy, Yonko. You can introduce yourself with him. Alright, so it's a, little, it's a nice little reaction video since we haven't given you guys that in a while. And it's a fight scene like how we're trying to do with that series. This show is called The Legend of Vox Machina. It's on Amazon Prime and this show is so bloody and gory and funny. It's just, it's just amazing. So this particular scene is going to be Grog versus his uncle. But it's gonna be like the whole group for some of them. And yeah, like let's just get into it. And Grog looks like he he, he dead ass looks like um my guy Kratos from God of War right now with the beard and the tattoos. But yeah, let's get into it. If y'all seen it, cool. I have not seen it, so I don't know what's about. But we might, you know, Yonko's gonna explain it after we watch this. But let's get into it. What the thing is? I got more. It's been five seconds. He already believes. <laughs> He got thrown into a wooden stake. The thing was was right here, pushed all the way through. Uh, oh, so pushed several times. So you're telling me there's more fighting after this? Before this? No, no, no. I'm saying like he's already. Oh yeah, yeah, he's yeah, already yeah. like this. Oh yeah, there's, there's more fighting. Let's get into it. Sorry about that. Fox Machina. Fuck shit. You heard the man! You know what this reminds me of? You know how old anime movies or like like English dub movies they used to have metal rock music like in the background? <laughs> Bro, that was the I best. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Like but any Dragon Ball Z movie, I would like to you know, see it's like, oh, in the cooler movie, they have like literally like a guitar solo with like all Goku. the time, bro. Goku would be getting, getting whooped, <laughs> and then you hear a guitar solo, or whatever, <laughs> Super Saiyan. <laughs> time, man. They need to bring back rock music in uh, animation, bro. Good times, good times. Is he the MC? Or is that she? Is she the MC? Which one? The one who's just doing work. <laughs> that, that was two different characters. They're twins. One has a bow and arrow, one uh, uses knives. Are, are those the MCs? Nah. So the side character's cold too. Basically all of them are the MCs will be in the hood with okay, you. Okay, okay. Oh, so it's like um, uh, uh, Castlevania. Yeah. Multiple MCs. All right, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Because the blood scenes just might be Castlevania. It'll give you that vibe. So they got scraps. Oh yeah. Well he has scraps. Does she just walk that long? Yeah, she said Kept moving. You hey, you know what that th fear? And then threw her axe down with no show. Was she healing? No. <laughs> no. Yeah, she ain't walking that off. <laughs> That's like a thing to do. <laughs> he basically advertised the whole thing. Does she control more than this plant? Yeah. That's something broke. Imagine you get knocked out and you look up and you see a fix in the air. Do they even have rock music in this timeline, bro? How does he know the rock and roll side? He knows rock music, yeah. Oh my god. Basically his his ability is like he's like um one of those people who like 
do instruments. I don't know the name of it, but instrumentals. Yeah, like he does anything. Like he plays. He can basically use. He can make illusions. He can create hard construct. He's basically like Green Lantern with music. Yeah, like a Green Lantern musical. Yeah, with bloody gore. Yeah, <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you, this whole time I watched this, I didn't know who the bad guy was. Oh, it's him? Oh, because I thought the dude with the beard was the bad guy. I didn't know who was the bad guy. Though in the beginning, he said fuck shit up and then they came out the shadows. Okay, just the bad guy said fuck shit up too. <laughs> <laughs> you, I, have you been seeing how they murder people? <laughs> now you tell me who the hero. <laughs> now you tell me who the hero. <laughs> Nah, this was cold. This was cold. The way this this dude handled this. <laughs> Demonetize. Demonetize. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, YouTube. That is badass. Did he use the hand? He just he took off his back to me. Hell of your storms. Do not like these weaklings. Get the factory of your old friend. This is like the most toxic, toxic masculinity I've ever seen in a shit in a series ever, bro. <laughs> <laughs> bro just works his arm out. <laughs> and you so stunned that you don't see the arm with the other arm <laughs> coming to smack you. Sad days. This isn't going well! Yeah, you don't say. He got stronger with one of them. <laughs> he got stronger. Son. Father. <laughs> I too have got disciplined with a head, but. <laughs> Happens every day, you know. The perfect way to discipline the children. <laughs> I thought he was just gonna snap his neck with his hand, but he said, nah. Why are you fighting me? <laughs> <laughs> Wash dishes. <laughs> Come on now. God, I hope this works. So I'm drinking too much. Give me the space. Did you just summon a Pokemon? Basically. Wanna try something crazy? Fuck yeah. <laughs> That's a typical me in a Destro conversation. Show him who you are! You're gonna act like she ain't just throw him four stories in the air and he landed that thing smoothly? I wanna say smoothly, but he, 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 he did something. Great <laughs> shockwave. He hit the ground so hard he fell. Fire. I see. Jesus! Oh, I'm about to say, I was like, why is he still alive? I was about to say, why is he still walking, bro? I was like, please don't tell me he's still alive. Okay, okay. What's this show about? <laughs> What, what did I do with this? <laughs> Alright, so to give a quick summary of the show, basically that band of, they're, they're a band of mercenaries. So there's the twins, Vex and Vax. Okay. Uh, there's Scallon was the dude who was playing with the uh, fist. He's a gnome. The holy priest was the uh, dwarf. Grog was the dude who just delivered a top rope Hammer fix with an axe. I know who he's explaining right now. It's going in one ear out the other. I want to know what it's about because I don't even go remember these games. Ah, fuck the names. Okay, so basically, <laughs> uh, it starts off where they 
like basically just pick a mission to um, help the king or whatever to get gold and just get fame. Okay. And they end up facing a dragon. And they ended up. That's how my missions go as well. <laughs> and this is just like the first two episodes. First they end up job. fighting the dragon. I'm not gonna tell you how that ends. And from there, it just progressively gets like they just start progressively going to like characters' backstories. Like mm -hmm. the dude with the glasses. That's my favorite character. He's so cold. The first season, I felt like he was so cold, and then they kind of nerfed him. Okay. Like, if you guys want me to show the reaction to, like, something like what happened there, I can show you, but just put in the comments. But they're basically just a band of misfits who are just trying to, like, gain fame, and they end up becoming heroes of the kingdom protectors. And they're just trying to protect the kingdom. Like, shit hits the fan in season two. Okay. Season two, shit gets real. Like, they fought one dragon in the second episode. Season two has four dragons they gotta fight. Mm -hmm. And yeah, that was just one of the, you saw it took all of them basically to take out him. Mm -hmm. he, he literally just had, his gauntlets were just making him strong. He was just like a normal person with just strong gauntlets. That was like the dude's uncle. Okay. The dragon scene? Oh no, they had to. They had to. They had to put in work. <laughs> and this is on Amazon? Yeah, Amazon Prime. Amazon be cooking with the animations when they got time. You know, invincible. Take three months off. Give us four episodes, whatever. But y'all be cooking, y'all be delivering on the episode, so I ain't too bad. Yeah, but I'll really check this out. It's really good. I spent all day yesterday finishing <laughs> season one and two because I was bored and put it on while I was you know, sick. <laughs> and, and it's not small. There's like 30 minutes. There's like 12 episodes per season. As you can see, Yanko has no life. I have a problem. It's, it's, <laughs> this was this is peak college anime days. Yeah. 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 Anyway, you can go ahead and close out one up. But yeah, uh, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and as always, we'll be all out.